Hi, and welcome to jhudgens.com Tech Tips channel, where I upload all kinds of very helpful networking, technology, and VoIP tutorials to help you in your business, hobby, or just around the house. If you like what you see here today and you find these tutorials helpful, please subscribe and click that bell because I'm constantly uploading very helpful content for the general public to use. In this Jay Hudgens Tech Tips video, I'm going to show you how to install a Yealink WF40 Wi-Fi USB dongle onto a Cordal hosted Yealink T46G VoIP phone. Before we get started, I want to tell you about a company that specializes in almost everything telecom. This company is US Tech. For years, US Tech has been an industry leader in telephone systems, SIP protocol gateways, voice over IP, and UC client. U.S. Tech has a reputation of giving over-the-top tech support, and right now U.S. Tech is giving away free Yaling VoIP phones for every seat that you sign up for. They can even pre-program a system and have it shipped right away while they stay on standby for any reasonable assistance necessary. Is your phone bill too high? Let them drastically reduce your monthly bill using SIP protocol. Just click on the link in the description below to get a free quote and even a callback if needed. That's US Tech, your one-stop shop for everything telecom. They do it all for you. Now the first thing you want to do is install the USB dongle on the bottom of the phone. Alright, once the dongle is installed on the bottom of the phone, you're going to see Network Unavailable. So, click OK. Let's click on Menu. We're going to arrow over and down to Basic. Now we're going to arrow down to the eighth selection, which is Wi-Fi. Go ahead and push OK or Enter. And you see our Wi-Fi is set to off, so go ahead and arrow forward to On. Let's push Save. Now it's scanning for Wi-Fi networks available. Okay, it has found uh, the one that we're looking for, so go ahead and click on the one that you want to choose. And it says connected. It says connected now because I've already connected to this network, so it didn't ask me for username and password. But generally, it'll ask you for a password when you select that Wi-Fi network, and then you just go ahead and enter the password. After you put in the password, it's gonna say connected, and then you're set to go. Go ahead and click back, exit, and you're ready to call. Hey, you know, a lot of people ask me, how do you record your computer screen like that? I tell them it's so easy with Camtasia from TechSmith. In my opinion, Camtasia is the most affordable and easiest recording software to learn. You don't need a big budget or fancy video editing skills. Simply record your screen, add a few effects, callouts, musical backgrounds, and bam, you're done. Upload it directly to YouTube or your computer or whatever video hosting site you choose. It's that easy. And right now, Camtasia is letting my friends try it out for free for one month. You can't lose with that deal. Just click on the link in the description below and start your free trial today.